We earned the wristband, we earned the wetsuit rash, and we earned the medal. Wow, 30th annual Escape from Alcatraz Triathlon has been completed. What a day we had. Another safe and successful escape. We had ideal conditions weather-wise. Tides were pulling just in the right direction. It was one of the fastest, safest swims we've had in years. We also had nine past champions race with us. We also had over a dozen challenged athletes complete the course as well. In the women's professional elite race was a very tight race. Leander Cave dropping the hammer on the run with the fastest women's run split for the day. Leander Cave, 214.34. Jenna Shoemaker, 214.47. Mary Beth Ellis, 217.27. McKeeley Jones, eight time winner. She was fourth here today, two hours, 20 minutes, 37 seconds. Rebecca Wittenock Huber rounding up the top five, 226.02. In the men's professional elite race, we saw first place flip flop in the swim, also on the bike. Once again, Hunter Kemper for his second win brought his A game out on the run, and the rest of the men could not keep up with him. Hunter Kemper bringing his second win here at Alcatraz, breaking two hours, 158.21. Bevan Doherty, second place, two hours, 24 seconds. Andy Potts, three-time consecutive winner over the last few years, 20202 for third place. Chris Macca McCormick, a four-time winner here, fourth place, 20208. And from Spain, Francis Godet, 20212. In the next few weeks, we invite you to log on to the Escape from Alcatraz Triathlon.com website and keep an eye out for the official list of dates, times, and local television affiliates that will be broadcasting the television production of the Escape from Alcatraz Triathlon, the 30th anniversary edition. Keep an eye open for qualifications and registration information about the 31st annual Escape from Alcatraz Triathlon coming next year, June 5th, 2011, for the 31st annual Escape from Alcatraz Triathlon. This is Eric Gilson. Take care.